Bozer continued on towards the center of the pyramid and stood on top of his new throne. If he wishes to be the god of the flames of darkness, Bozer has to conquer of all ancient Egyptian gods. He must seek the Egyptian god of darkness and lord of the dead, Anubis. From the light comes the dark, lies the pyramid of light. There in this pyramid lies the darkness of the Lord of the Dead. His powers are vast and terrible, and even Bozer cannot fear him. But Bozer must face him, for every night Anubis sleeps. He slumbers in his tomb in Egypt, waiting to awaken and destroy any who dare trespass upon his domain. destruction. 
I shall request this task to you, Bowser of the Koopa Tribe. <laughs> Your greatest challenge awaits at my city of the dead, Amanitra, where my servant, Styles High Priest, imparted his mama third alive by Sedai's bodyguards. As I speak, the Pharaoh's bodyguards pay the ultimate price for my servant's death. The puppet killed Setter and accomplished this task I myself gave him. As the bodyguards of Setter's punishment, I cursed them in my city of the dead, bringing them out to win silver at this chest. Your task is to find the flame of darkness and extinguish its life. If you succeed, your quest will complete. And if I am able to do this, to kill the Pharaoh's bodyguards. I shall receive the gift of immortality. Complete this task, and you shall receive eternal life. You shall become the god of the dark fire. Have faith in the darkness, boss. I do not forget those who come to my aid. Leaving Seti's bodyguards in eternal torment in their own city of the dead, Bozer sets out to find this flame of darkness, which Anubis promised he would know of. His greatest challenge, and a path to become a god lay before him in the ancient city of Hamanatra, ancient burial sites for the sons of pharaohs and resting place for the wealth of Egypt. <laughs> 